skipped today's filming yesterday. Um, to get up to speed, we checked into Cabana Bay in the morning, had a volcano view room, which was really cool, especially at night when it was all lit up. We had a couple of hours around the pool there with a couple of cocktails, which was very nice and very relaxing. Uh, we went to the Hard Rock Cafe on City Walk. We had a couple of burgers and stuff and a massive tower of onion rings again. It was alright, it wasn't amazing, but it's all pretty nice. We then went into Universal for a second go at Horror Nights. Uh, went into Finnegan Stay and Screen area and had a beer and got in the queue to be released into the park because we wanted to do Stranger Things first. About 10 minutes before we got released, it absolutely lashed down. And if you know Florida rain, then it proper lashed down. We were both completely drenched through, which was my fault apparently because I left the rucksack in a room so I didn't want to carry it around. It had the raincoats in it. Um, we did the Stranger Things house, about half hour queue. Uh, we squelched our way through it. It was really good. It was, didn't blow us away like we hoped it would, but it was really, really good and clever how they do it and Demogorgon's jumping out of you and stuff, so awesome. Today we are now back at the Ramada, just got back and we are going to Walmart in a moment, which is literally over there. Uh, after that we're going to go to the outlets, uh, do a bit of shopping, see if we can get any deals, hopefully not too much because we haven't got any room in our case really, so we might have to chuck some stuff if we do buy a load of stuff. After that, going to come back here and have an hour or so at the pool, we've got the beers hopefully. And then tonight we are going down at Disney Springs for the first time this trip. And we've got paddlefish booked in, which we did have booked the other day, but we cancelled it because we were too hot and tired. So uh, this time, fingers crossed. And it's magical dining month in Orlando and paddlefish is one of the participating restaurants, which means we can get a three course meal for $35 each. And we'll be getting some margaritas and wandering around Disney Springs and doing some shopping or window shopping anyway. So. We shall show you that. I probably won't show shopping at the outlets because watching somebody shop is probably quite boring. But uh, we will show you what we got and film some other stuff later on. Cheers. Okay, so shopping at the outlets has been shopped. Now uh, we didn't stay there for too long so we can't buy too much because we're going... Oh, we haven't got a room in our suitcase. So this is the stuff I bought from all from Penguin. Which is basically my whole wardrobe is from Penguin. And some shorts there. That came to $100 which is about £75. I think it's pretty good. And then Cara bought this lovely little purse that she had her eye on. I won't say how much that cost, but it's very, very nice. And yeah, weather has gone rainy again, so we'll wait and see if that clears so we can go in the pool. If not, we shall see you at Disney Springs. <laughs> Piano Man, Rolling Piano Man I just found. We have made it to Disney Springs, uh, finally. Uh, we've got about an hour before our reservation of Paddlefish, so we're just doing a bit of shopping and probably get a drink of some sort. Surprise. Yeah, exactly. So uh, yeah, we'll show you some of Paddlefish because uh, we've never been there before and the food's meant to be really nice. And we've got this magical dining menu which is only $35 each. And with it being a signature restaurant, hopefully, it's going to be money. See you in a bit. Okay, so just come out of Paddlefish, so a little review. Um, for drinks, I had the old fashioned with bourbon cocktails, very nice. And you had? I had a sangria, which is really nice. Well, then we had the, the bread with whipped cinnamon butter, which was really, really good. And at the start, I had clam chowder, which I've never had before, but really, really enjoyed. And then my main, I had shrimp and grits, which was pretty good. It wasn't amazing, but pretty good. And then a slightly disappointing but amazing looking key lime pie to finish off with. Um, what was your starter? I had fried green tomatoes, which didn't even have any taste to it, to be honest. But didn't really like it. And your main? The main was horrible, I'm afraid. I had catfish in this really crusty fry. I think, I don't even know, it was just really crunchy and horrible. And so, then, yeah, yeah, again, the key lime pie. 
But uh, anyway, that's just our experience. You might have an amazing meal here. Yeah. And they do have an incredible bar with a hell of a view at the top. So feel free to come and enjoy it. I'm going to give it, we haven't got a ranking system, but six and a half. Cheers. Six. <laughs> I don't know if you can see us properly, but we are finishing our night now down Disney Springs with a dockside margarita. Yeah, have it. Habanero lime one, and you've got the special honey mango. Honey mango. Nice. So, yeah, we're just going to finish these. I think there might be some music coming on down here in a bit, and then head back to the hotel. Probably not the longest vlog ever today, so we haven't done a great deal. But, uh, no, I've just been trying to find a white album. Yeah, it's a long story. Long but, yeah. story. But, yeah. That person who knows. <laughs> <laughs> right. See ya. <laughs>